Hello guys, today I will be solving the three, uh, Rubik's Cube 3x3 three three. but first we need to know about the pieces. This is a centerpiece. This is a centerpiece which does not does not change its original position. Like if I move it, it moves with the other pieces. This is an edge piece which has two colors, one on the top and one on the front. And this is an corner piece which has three uh, which has three colors. One on right or left or and one on the top. So let's get started and solve this Rubik's cube. First we need to find the yellow center which is the opposite on the opposite side of the white center. So here is the yellow center for and we need to align four across around it. A cross happens when four edge pieces around the white piece is around, is around the white piece. Now we need to form a cross a white of white pieces. Here is one uh, three white piece, a uh, one white piece edge. So we will we will flip the left layer and uh, move the right layer up. Now here is another white edge piece. So we will move the left layer up to to place the white piece. Now if the white edge white piece is here, we will first move the move it to either side and then move the move the cross left or right right depending upon the the way which you have moved it so i have moved left so i will move it to left and flip the right piece uh, right edge now we will match all of the edge other edge piece, white edge pieces other color to their respective center pieces right like here one red so we will do red red this is fi this is fixed so here we flip uh, we flip it all the way uh, uh, we flip it here uh, orange is formed so we flip it to the opposite side now we do two turns to make the uh, make the centerpiece al to align these and we flip it now the white side is almost completed so we study another the first algorithm that is lefty and righty algorithm if the white face of a corner is facing to the left side we use the righty algorithm which is right side up you upper layer down upper layer left right layer down upper layer right now here is the case of righty algorithm so we will do we will place it in the place where it has to go move it move the right left layer up right layer upper layer right right left layer down and upper layer right now this is right algorithm so this this 
lefty algorithm this 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 and this this uh, and if the white face is facing up we will do righty algorithm three times that is one that is two that is three and solved and here it is lefty algorithm so we will do left side up upper upper layer right right left layer down and upper layer right left now to make the second floor we will first see an edge piece where in which which there is no yellow so here is an edge piece which has no yellow we will make the edge piece align with the center piece of the front color like this here blue and see if it goes left or right it can go either left or right so we will turn it one step away from the from where it has to grow go like it has to go to the left so we will send it right then left layer up upper layer left and right layer up and we will just do this and we will just solve the corner like this this and this and done this this layer this edge piece is solved again here we have it has to go to the left so we will send it to the right do this method and just solve the corner piece this is the right uh, this has to go to the right side so we will do this and remove the corner piece remove the corner piece and then just solve the corner piece here we uh, here is the case of a flipped edge so we will just insert and insert any edge like here i am going to insert this one and this and this and it is inserted and the other edge piece is here so we will send it once one side one side away so this we have to send it here then remove the edge and just solve the edge uh, corner uh, corner again now the second layer is done there can there can be three ways how the upper part lo upper yellow pieces look like an l shape here a dot only a dot and and a and a line and if the cross is formed then you can skip this part if if your cross has one has one or three edges it is unsolvable and you have to remove remove and put an edge together again so here is le the l l position so i will do will do i will flip the the rights i will send the right front layer i will flip the front layer once then do the righty algorithm and place the edge back 
so here it forms an horizontal line and do this same again and put the edge back so the cross has been formed now it can be three ways how the cross is aligned with the with the center pieces the edge pieces are aligned with the center pieces it can be across each other like here blue and there green or it can be beside each other like here in my case and it can or it can it has no it has no no aligned it, it is not aligned and if it is fully aligned you can skip this part if it is not aligned with any not aligned then just do this algorithm this algorithm is called soon you have to do this set it to the back and just fix it again so this makes the beside one or the cross now this this is the beside one so we will do this algorithm again and the the all the edge pieces are aligned now we will place all these corner pieces into the correct place and here one corner piece is already in his correct place so we and if the corner piece there are two ways if the corner piece all the corner pieces are not then we sh we will use a new algorithm Nic called Nicholas and if one is formed uh, one is there then we will put that corner piece at the left side and do this Nicholas algorithm like this and it is solved huh? and if it's not solved like that uh, this and if it's not solved like this then we will do then we will uh, will make the left the yellow side at the bottom and do this algorithm do write the algorithm until the edge piece uh, the corner piece is solved like one two and three here again do three one two and this uh, and this should be solved